Hey, your favorite duo is back on the Inside Edge. This is Eric Harlow. How are you doing, everybody? And I'm Karen Rao here to talk about skiing pathways after high school. This is part three of these, this video series. And we want to make sure that our high school students know where they are going to ski after they graduate. So let's listen to Eric uh, educate us on that. Hey, everybody, we're back with part three of the Keyhole Conundrum. Part three is choices. You have many choices like we talked about in the first two episodes. There are over 200 schools that offer you an opportunity to ski race in college. But where do you start? Well, first of all, Karen was kind enough to obtain a document from USCSA detailing a list of schools way over 200 by the way. Actually, it's still right around 200, but it's a list of schools that's sortable, okay? It's a Microsoft Excel document, and we'd like to thank them for that. What Karen and I have done is we've sorted that document by state that the school's in, the size of the school, and whether or not the school's a club or varsity-led program by either a coach or a student. Still though, it's a huge list. So where do you start? Here's what we recommend. Number one, is where okay some of you may want to go to school in Colorado some in California some of you may even want to go to school in Connecticut or North Carolina or Virginia Michigan Maine New Hampshire the first thing to do is establish where you want to go where in the country number two where do you fit what are your grades where can you get in that's really important so fit, grades. What else are some of the fits? What's the size of the school? Is it liberal arts? Is it a big university? Those are the things you're gonna to wanna to start considering next. Number three, and all the way down to number three. What ski experience are you looking for? Coach-led, student-led, varsity, club, what level, what conference. These are the things you're gonna to wanna to find out next. What are you looking for in a skiing experience in college? Number four, we're gonna to work together with you to find the right fit. Okay, given all these things, Karen and I are gonna work with you and your families to find the fit. And then number five, you gotta go see it, okay? A lot of these places are gorgeous, places you've never heard of. You gotta go see them and give them a chance. So go see it. Karen and I really think that this is gonna help you guys choose the right school for you. Again, this thing is a keyhole. If you wanna ski in college and you're only considering the NCAA, that's a big mistake. There are a lot of opportunities out there for you to ski race in college and you don't have to worry about having your points at the 20 or low 20 or mid teens. There are a lot of opportunities out there. You gotta get out there and find them and we're here to help. Good luck. So there you have it, skiing pathways after high school. I'd like to thank Eric Carlo for all the work that he has done um, in putting these videos together. And I definitely wanna thank the USCSA um, for allowing me to see some of this information um, and to help our students here at Sugar Bowl Academy.